This is Nikki Knack, and this is my gritty journal of adventuring. Coughing cactus needles. We were born to explore. Okay, so Kiwi was born in Crazy Pete's pet shop, but once he was old enough to move out, all he did was explore. That's what brought us together. A green-haired gerbil and a pink-haired adventurer. We could not be stopped. Well, unless a cactus with a head cold started shooting needles at our noggins. We don't belong here, Kiwi shouted as we ran through Head Cold Hollow. The coughing cactus needles zipped past our heads. Kiwi was right. We didn't belong here. A coughing cactus? A sneezing pine tree? Even the river had a sore throat. All the plants here should have been sent to the nurse's office. But I could see our escape. Our flying air balloon was resting near the edge of a cliff. We ran for it. I heard a cough. The cactus fired again. Time slowed down. Kiwi jumped. He sailed past my nose. Needles flew at me like darts. Hiya! Kiwi swung deflecting needles with all four paws. Well, deflecting four of them. The rest, let's just say he looked a little like a porcupine. But we kept running. We leaped into the flying air balloon basket and floated down the side of the cliff, slowly, gently. I let out a breath and got to work. Using an extra pin from the air balloon's tank, some bubble gum, and one of my unusually strong strands of hair, I made a cactus needle removal kit. Maybe I can make you less pokey, I told Kiwi. And thanks for your help out there. No problem. We belong together, Kiwi said. He tried not to think about the needle stuck in his fur. I reached for a paw and then... (coughs) Needles. Right into our balloon. Pop! The balloon dropped like a bucket of bowling balls. The rushing wind stung my eyes. I couldn't see. Maybe that was good. Who wants to watch themselves crash? I closed my eyes and held on.